So I've seen a lot of short clips or I've seen this um, podcast that has been trending of Sida Bosch, Abby, Sad Bosch or whatever her name is, you understand. And a lot of people have been having opinion about it. She she will drag a, anybody that talks about her, she will drag the person, the person will drag her. People have been dragging her, some people have been saying she's misleading people, she's doing this, she's doing that, she's not a good example to this. She's See, let me tell you guys, if you know the secret of content creation, you will know that some of these content creators or some of these influencers are looking for a way to blow by all means necessary and to me i don't believe jack shit of anything said about she said about 20 million naira. somebody has to give her 20 million naira in a week if she if you're if you're chatting with her in the morning before in the evening the evening she will bill you you have to give her a minimum of five hundred thousand for nibo where where it's in lie the truth of the matter is that she is looking for a means to be controversial she has found her niche and her niche is trying to make people feel like oh more i'm all about the money 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 kind of situation you understand i'm not that kind of ego shock when i went side that voice will marry for on top of this same um, um internet when we did because you know that if you look if you go and search about said that you will know that she has tried so many things in fact there's a video of her even making where she was you know that even the love itself she don't try and before she gets heartbreak and then she switch she do comedy comedy no work now she don't find another niche where they work for her. she has found a niche that is working for her she has found a niche that will get her into people's mouths that will make people talk about her because the truth of the matter is that when you're doing anything about social media when you're a content creator you're an influencer you're, you want to be a social media sensation you have to look for a means to break into the market and to be really honest with you Sida has found a way to break into the market which is this controversy she has created because for the last three to four days she has been on everybody's lips that oh everybody will come out to give an up that is what she wants that is what she wants and she has gotten it to be on everybody's lips whether the, the, the unfortunate part is that she is on the wrong path and the truth of the matter is on this same internet space that we are the only way you the one of the easiest way not the only way one of the easiest way to break into limelight is to go against the crowd you understand is to be controversial those are part of the this drag you they drag me and they drag you or some kind of situation like that like to just be toxic to just be negative to just go out of the norm or to just be different you know make people talk about you whether what you saying you believe in it or not just say it say it so that you have people having opinion about what you have said trying to counter what you have said or trying to attack you or trying to you know insult you when you get to that point where people have started seeing you and being like oh is it not this girl that said so so thing is it not this girl that did so so thing is that is the peak she was looking for and she has gotten it because you tell me why who which man in this nigeria will give a lady in, in one week 20 million naira when no one use you do jazz when no one use you do money medicine Tell me, we will sweat you as a man watching me, no matter how rich you are as a millionaire, you just met a girl and in a week you're giving the girl 20 million to 50 million naira. Say what in there between her legs. Now what in you know with some of some of the things what in between her legs, you will even collect them from another person free. Do you understand? She is trying to be controversial and she has succeeded. So Farabale is not that deep to me. That's how I see it. She was looking for a way to break into limelight and she don't break into her because at least now everybody don't know celebrities are dragging her, people are talking about her, castigating her. Now at least if her picture pass. People they know say, oh, maybe this girl will talk about 20 million naira. And at the end of the day, she will leverage on it. Even the fact that you people they've reported her page and she has gone out of her in social media. She is she is back. She will, she she must have created backup pages and she will still grow. The fact that people don't they know her face. People don't they know her. that's the tricks to growing on social media. Side of she knows knows what she <laughs> she knows what she's doing because I don't want to believe that she's like that. Leave your thoughts in the comment section.